Hi Big Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from an east central Wisconsin field where a dairy farm is chopping soybean straw for bedding for its cows. The farm raises soybeans as a supplement in the feed for the cows and in the fall they harvest the soybeans with a combine. Here we can see an international 1460 axle flow combine that was manufactured from 1977 through 1985. It's rated at 170 horsepower and holds 180 bushels of beans before it unloads. The combine collects the grain and spreads the straw back out on the ground where the farm then will collect it to become bedding for the dairy herd. The farm chops the soybean straw left behind by the combine with an international 5088 tractor. This 135 PTO horsepower machine was manufactured from 1981 through 1985. It's powering a New Holland FP230 pull type forge harvester that is filling Miller forge boxes. New Holland FP230 pull type forge harvester chops the soybean straw into a fine bedding. When the miller wagons are full of material, the tractor drives over and switches out with a Farmel M tractor that is rated at 36 PTO horsepower. This classic international was manufactured from 1939 through 1954. It transports the wagons back to the farm where they're unloaded into the barn for storage. The Farmel M tractor delivers the Miller forge boxes back to the farm and uses its PTO to unload the soybean straw into an International 56 silo blower, powered by an International 826 gear drive tractor with a custom cab. This tractor is rated at 92 PTO horsepower and was built from 1969 through 1971.
I hope you've enjoyed seeing the soybean straw chopping process. Does your farming operation chop or bale soybean straw? I'd like to hear about the tractors and implements that are involved in your operation in the comment section below this video. If you've enjoyed the video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. As always, thank you for watching.